to welcome everyone to the Aquaware 5 gallery in menus video. In this video, I'll just be showing you how to maneuver through the new Aquaware interface and get the maximum impact while using Aquaware 5. So the first thing you'll notice is that when Aquaware 5 comes up, we have several tabs here along the ribbon tab. This is very common to Microsoft products. We have a drop down here on the left. This allows you to check out Aquaware, the MDM website, online resources. We have, again, the website. We have the Aquaware 5 online community. We have contact if you want to get in contact with me. Of course, my Facebook, Google Circles, and Twitter. We also have the medical disclaimer, very important. I am not a medical practitioner and I don't pretend to be. Anything that you read or observe uh, using the products is strictly on your own with no medical advice intended. And of course, so again, you can access from the start tab, you can access the online resources. Here we have the user instructions. We have the intent index, and these are both online PDFs. We have the video tutorials. We have mode selection. We have history. This very quickly allows you to glance at which intents that you have been using. It basically logs everything that you do with Aquaware over time. You can delete the history. We have the skins gallery. We, of course, we have the color picker. Now, all of the intent menus are set up the same the ribbon tabs okay you'll notice on the left here we always have a water palette on each one of the tabs which encompasses using the percentage we have the water prep we have the user prep and of course and of course the nucleation now what you'll notice is on the galleries you can simply move through the galleries like this and then it'll show you exactly what it is and there's two arrows over here two drop down arrows and of course they take you through the galleries as well now the bottom arrow actually opens up the gallery and allows you to see all the intents okay of course this is being brilliant beings grouping one we have sculptors writers painters musicians dancers and of course brilliant minds coming over to the advanced feature tab again we have the water palette water preparation user preparation and nucleation we have the user intent cards build a quantum layering session run a quantum layering session and of course the CIS or the custom intent sessions you can upload an image nucleate the water or edit or delete any of the custom intents that show up in your gallery and of course this gallery here holds the same principles you can move up or down or you can open it up to see all of your custom intents in there so the interface has really been the same since aquaware version 3 but has been more refined and polished over the last two versions including aquaware 3.1 aquaware 4 and of course now Aquaware 5. Up here, again, we have a mode selection. You can very quickly get to it. We have medical disclaimer. Over here, we have the about button. It shows you the current version, which is Aquaware 5. Down here is standby mode. So it's pretty simple to navigate through Aquaware. Again, if you're new to Aquaware, just take your time. Use beginner mode. Watch all the videos. Read the manual. We have access to open up a help desk ticket on the website I generally get back to people within 24 hours and we can move you through any issues that you are having again this is the aquaware 5 galleries and menus video thank you